Welcome to 360 Degree Machinery. If you have any questions, comments, or if you have surplus machinery you would like to sell, you can reach us at info at 360degreemachinery.com. For an up-to-date list of available machines, please visit us on the web at 360degreemachinery.com. In addition to what is listed on our website, we also have 50 plus additional machines being processed. So check back often as we do not list machines until they have been thoroughly cleaned and tested. Also remember that all of our machines are located in-house and that we do not broker tools to guarantee quality. This is an SEMI 36 inch UNO dual head wide belt sander. Uh, these machines have a really good reputation for durability and dependability. Uh, this machine was small shop owned and it is very well maintained as you can see. The actual model is an UNO RCS. Now remember we are showing you the front, the back and all of this video so that you can see exactly what you would be buying. Um, front, back, left, right, inside and out. Uh, on the floor you can see we do have the leveling pods along with the wrench to adjust your heads and the manuals for both the Accurate Pro Scale and the machine itself. Again, this machine is two heads uh, configured with one motor, one larger horsepower motor. Overall, it's gonna have a lower amp draw than a machine with two motors. And remember this, that a dual head is at least three times faster than a single head. Uh, the reason why is you, obviously a single head, you got have one grit per pass. This will allow you two grits per pass, but you don't have to return the material. So it's a minimum of three times faster than a single head. On this particular machine, the first head features a five and a half inch helical groove steel drum. Your second head is a combination head. It's gonna feature a five and a half inch grooved rubber drum. We did dress that drum. Uh, it is defect memory free. There's no valleys, uh, no damage to it. More importantly, it has really nice deep grooves, has about 90% of life left. Uh, that is disposable at some point in this machine's life. So again, a lot of life. You're gonna be able to dress that out many more times. Uh, up here and right up front here, you do have your adjustment to bring those drums up and down. Of course, you do have your platen that is in good condition. And up here, you do have your adjustment for that platen. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and turn this machine on real fast so you can see it running. Both of those heads on this machine run off of a single motor. Uh, the advantage of this is that it's gonna be lower power consumption. So you're going to have about 93 max total amps on this machine at 230 volts three phase. That motor is 22 kilowatts or 30 horsepower. The disadvantages is if you're sanding wide glue ups, you're gonna to have to turn your feed speed down but this machine only features two feed speeds, so it's not an issue because you're simply gonna turn it down to the first feed speed. Of course, this is your emergency stop, twist to reset. This is the reset for the whole machine. As you can hear, we've just reset everything. Uh, this machine does feature a six inch daylight opening, 36 inch width capacity. Right now it's reading a little over six inches raises and lowers as it should. This is an unusual option because most of these machines have manual rise and fall of that table. It does work as it should. This machine does have an additional Accurate Technologies Pro Scale added to it. It also does have the original numeric readout over here. It does work. This is just gonna give you a little bit more accuracy. This machine also features dual feed speeds. The feed mat is defect free. It's probably about 50, 60% of life left. There is some crazing in the mat, but that is pretty much what you're gonna find in the waffle mats after 10 years or so. We're gonna put it in the high speed. Again, works as it should. 
Up top, you do have an amp meter, of course your stop button. Um, right here, you do have your start button. As you can hear, the brakes did engage. We're gonna reset this real fast. Turn this feed mat on. And of course, right here, you do have a gate for over thickness travel. If your material is too thick, it should hit this top gate. When it does, it will turn that conveyor off. And again, to reset everything, you simply hit that emergency stop and then hit your reset button. On the right-hand side of the machine, you're gonna find your auto calibration unit right here. All you're simply going to do is put your workpiece in right here, slide it until it touches this point right here, and raise it up. Uh, when that wood hits the top contact switch in here, it will again turn off your bed and it will adjust your thickness. And below, behind that grate, below your pneumatic controls, you do have that 30 horsepower motor. It's a belt drive and it kind of slaves both of those heads together. This machine does have updated electronic eye tracking. Finally, we're gonna take a look at the back side of this machine. If you have any questions or comments, you could reach us at info at 360degreemachinery.com. Again, thank you for tuning in to 360 Degree helping you buy with confidence.